Okay, I figured I'd cut some video. Uh, this is what I'm up against my kayak out here in Newport. Um, I've been paddling all over the place like a freaking nut because I wanted to shoot that lighthouse over there. That's Castle Hill Lighthouse. And uh, I got a sticker on my car now. It says paddle to your ass aches. And uh, my ass is aching. So the boats are starting to get set up. I think the kickoff time, I don't know. It was all messed up. So who knows? But I'm out here anyways. And uh, I went over, took some photos of, uh, I forget the name of that, Rose Hill Lighthouse, I think it is. And uh, that was earlier. Fort Adams is just back there. So I'm on my way there. Fortunately, I'm going with the tide. A little bit of wind to kick me in the butt, get, keep me going. So I'll, uh, I'll get back. I'll set up. I mounted the Viking helmet um, on the front of the kayak. I think it looks pretty cool. Kind of like a hood ornament. Um, I only have GPS today because my transducers uh, came out, it fell out of its positioning. So I'm gonna have to make a repair with that. A couple waves from that big boat coming now. So um, just floating over them. And that's it. I'm out here. Give a shot of me. You don't get too many of these. Hello. So I don't know if you can see me, but that's me. And that's it. Some crazy real estate here along this uh, shoreline. So, all right, I'll cut out, get back to the excitement later on. Okay, here I am. It's not race time yet, but uh, they kicked me out of the east side. I was way over there, uh, paddling back from Castle Hill Light. I got stopped about halfway across, and uh, they wouldn't let me hug the shoreline. They threw me out. I had to come to the freaking, from this side of the bay, over to this side of the bay, um, well, to see the show anyway, so whatever, it didn't make a difference, but uh, I'm going to have a little bit of a longer paddle home. Coast Guard's out here, more friggin' personnel out here, um, for whatever reason, keep these uh, keep this course clear, I guess, but they haven't started racing yet, but the boats are out here. See them going by right there? Well, not that one. I'm not that close, believe me. So it's going to be a kind of a tough shooting day, I guess. But I'm going to try and sneak in as close as I can get once they do start racing. It's kind of hanging in the wing right now. And uh, take my chances, like always, just to get that shot. So this uh, it's quite interesting out here. you got to keep moving. They won't let you stay still at anchor. They, they closed off most of the east passage. The west, this, this, this west side is open right here. So um, it's pretty interesting. A lot of, a lot of boat wash, but I can deal with that, no problem. So I thought I wish people could anchor that way there. Um, I could tie off to somebody's boat and uh, not have to keep paddling up and get the tide against me here, the wind against me. I paddle up and then I drift back. So that's what I've been. That's pretty much what I've been doing. So a lot of boats out here, not a lot, but you know, enough to keep it interesting. So, all right, back uh, when it's race time, I guess. All right, well, I'm gonna close this out for now. Um, wasn't what I expected, it was all right. It's still, uh, it's still racing here. I gotta, I would, I'm gonna head back though. So I got a long, uh, long trip back, I had to go away. I'm almost there. We're way over there to the bridge and down and around. So, uh, yeah, it was pretty cool. So, I'm getting whistled at now. So, I think. I don't know. So, it pulls up now. Helicopters all over the place here. Doing some aerial stuff. Video of live feed over to uh, over to Fort Adams over there. So, that's it. Day's done. It's a big camera right there.